right, guys. Susan here. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, it has been a while since I put up a video because I've been ill. <laughs> Sorry to say it, but um, this is the best my voice gets right now. Uh, it was much, much worse. So making a video when you can't understand me it would have been useless. So hope you forgive my uh, absence here. But um, recently I got out to Value Village. Um, finally feeling a little bit better and wanted to get some fresh air and not to worry I was wearing a mask the whole thing hand sanitizer I wasn't making anybody else sick um, but I got some some air and got out of this house for a little bit went to Valley Village and I found some deals now I also uh, it was a Tuesday so it's a senior saving day and um, I happened upon these deals. This is a pack, 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 pack of bias tape. Now this um, is handy when it comes to sewing. Um, you get no more loose threads and, and seal your seams and everything. And it gives it such a nice finished product. Um, and the quantity of bias tape in here and the tag said $1.99, guys. <laughs> this was like, wow, score. Um, so there's lots of different colors. There's yellows and blues and greens, orange, there's beiges, pretty much anything I, I'm going to want. I do have some already, so this is going to fill out my selection. Um, and this thing here... I don't know why they package things the way they do. They just throw things randomly together and put a price on it. This was $3.99. And it's got a um, bunch of stuff in it. I'm going to open this one because it's all different stuff. And I want to explore it a little bit because you can't open it in the store. You have to <laughs> buy it first. Um, there is some... Um, feels like felt but it's a little more plasticky but it's um it's quite the big piece this is all folded over too right like this is huge um that's gonna come in handy for some kind of crafting um i'll have to investigate whether i can um sew this maybe into a uh a purse or something and make it stiffer because this is heavier duty right um, and then we have we have let's see we have a, a foam brush just a single one I don't know throw it in the junk drawer I'll find a use for it um, there are decorative clothes pins um, this is something you can get at the bookstore there's um, seven of them out of the eight and uh, they're kind of cute um, but again, making crafts, right? You can uh, whap a magnet on the back and throw it on your fridge. And if you have a an appointment card or something, just clip it in the clothespin. You're good to go. So there's that. There's this package, sealed package, of uh, tapes. It's decorative tapes. See. We got like a stripey one down there and then red and a green and um, it's got an Ikea sticker on it of all things I don't know what you're supposed to use it's crafty stuff for sure but there's one dispenser and then three separate rolls so you can change that out and we have a waft of these that all screw together um, and they're little um, containers that you can sort like little things like beads into, etc., and keep them all contained. And then you just pick out the one you want, and it's you know there's there's the beads or whatever you're using. Um, no idea what I'm going to use this for, but I got it. Uh, there's more. We got little googly eyes. Who doesn't love those things, eh? Um, a lot of people have used these. They're little stick-on jobs. 
and uh, a lot of people have used these. I've seen them um, put them on ketchup bottles and stuff in the fridge, and their their spouse opens up the fridge and gets a shock. <laughs> it's like, oh, everything's staring at me. <laughs> um, we have little uh, scissors with really uh, different blades on them. <laughs> little wavy cut to them. So those are those are going to be neat to try on fabrics and stuff. And we have two um, packs of uh, looks like uh, sewing floss. You know, like um, on embroidery or or cross stitch. Moline Special twenty five. 8 millimeter thread. Yeah, it's like an embroidery floss. It's kind of cool. You can never have too many um, products uh, when you're crafting because you never know. It's a creative process and you, and you just get um, throwing stuff together and make it work. <laughs> what I got this main package for was these. Okay, gourmet scented pencils. They're called smencils. I have never heard of these. The world's only gourmet scented pencils made from recycled, 100% recycled newspaper. 10 original smencils saving trees one pencil at a time. So you read the newspaper and stuff and then recycle it into this stuff and keep using it. Um, but I thought these are kind of cool and there's supposed to be 10 in here and sure enough there are 10. Um, one of them is missing a cap I think. Um, but that's fine. I mean it's in a plastic uh, bag. The zipper is closed so you keep the scent in there. But they have some funky um, some funky uh, scents them. They're all labeled so things like uh, syrup dippity, cherry vanilla, razzleberry, um, kinda cola. <laughs> oh here we go. Waffle cone, peach, perfect. Okay perfect and um, Pompeia. Yeah, let's see, what is this one? Sorta soda. It's kind of cool, a sorta soda. I don't know. <laughs> so um, I don't know how well I'm going to be able to smell these things um, because of being sick, but they're going to be interesting to uh, try later anyway. Wow, are these ever cool? Look at these. They're um, they're kind of plain, kind of cola, and I would imagine you'd sharpen them just like a regular pencil because it looks like it's it's the same side of kind of consistency as a pencil um, that you could sharpen. I don't know. I can't really smell it right now, so it's going to be a little tough until I can. But um, I'm looking forward to these things. These are kind of cool. And I thought, what a neat thing to have. So uh, there's one that's the lid's missing. So let's see what this one is. Gummy bear. Oh, wow. <laughs> this one got used. <laughs> Look at the, the erasers. <laughs> The eraser is uh, used on it and the point isn't as sharp. So this one was a favorite from somebody, whoever donated this stuff. Tube made in, uh, made from biodegradable plastic. So it's all about saving the trees and everything. So this is cool. Um, yeah, so there you have it. Um, one last note before I go. Um, when we were looking through Value Village this time, 
I of course went to the purse section because it's one of my my haunts, right? When I go thrifting, I always look at the purses. I have not bought a purse since I bought my leather one um, a long while ago now um, because I've been so disgusted with their prices, right? This time I noticed a good half of the rack was priced at $6.49. So hopefully I am having some kind of influence because I do not make it a secret on my channel that that is a sore spot for me when it comes to Value Village. So hopefully it's making some kind of a, a difference. Um, but I've, I've noticed definitely that they are um, altering the prices. So hopefully uh, keep up the pressure guys and I, I certainly have met a lot of people in there and um, right by the purse section and they're all just as disgusted as I am. Like these are donations. It's like make money on stuff you bring in brand new, yes. But donations should be cheaper. So um, thanks very much for watching and I hope to have more videos for you soon. But um, Again, I gotta get I, I gotta get well. My voice is uh, flaking out on me right now. So thanks again for watching and um, bearing with me as I work through this illness here. And uh, I'll be back with you as soon as possible. And thanks again, and we'll talk to you in the next one. Bye for now.